Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Alan Poff, MTG. Um, pretty much finished off with Kamigawa Neon Dynasty. Um, just waiting for new streets of uh, Capenna. So in the meantime, let's uh, crack open a juicy box of Jumpstart. Mm -hmm. So yeah. You guys have been watching my videos obviously again thank you love you appreciate you um as always like subscribe tell your friends tell your family and of course comments i love chatting with you guys talking about new stuff old stuff stuff that we've opened all that stuff all right so i'm watching a bunch of these breaks and they've been kind of kind of 50 50 so hopefully we get a good one starting off with discarding um, put those I'm gonna put the heads here and then, then, then. Or Rager. All right. I'm gonna put them in view there. I'll put the put the hits down there. So line these guys up. I'm gonna try and line them all up so we can do a thumbnail picture for the video. Let's see, devilish. It's a classic. Obviously, we're looking for some dinos, some elves, vampires, Phyrexians, Hellrider, Sin. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Down there. You know all these guys. Do, do, do. Thriving Bluff. And the Devil Skull Mountain. Is everybody super excited about... New Capenna, Streets of New Capenna. Today is, what is it, Wednesday, April 19th, 18th, 19th. And it seems like everybody's gotten their pre-release boxes. Or like, yeah, what do you call it? AGN, if your store, you, you get a couple boxes to test out. Walls, Towering Titan, nice, for the first Mythic. Uh, salt formation. The other guy. Wall of vines. That one's actually pretty cool. I'm gonna keep that one. Yeah, everybody seems to be loving the new um, whoa, smashing boo. The new gilded, gold gilded cards. So I think those are going to be kind of the, the semi chase lottery cards, even though they're not, you know, they're not as crazy um, sought after and all that. But people are saying they're going to be the new gold standard, literally, because they're gold. Um, for like awesome cards. Or treatments, foiling, right? Because it's not really like a foiling. It's more of like a treatment for the card. And it does look pretty awesome. Tree hugging. Boo. So far off to a pretty slow start. Primario Sage. Wall of Blossoms. I like that one as well. There and I'll just take a move the camera right at the last second at the end to get the good angle because the lighting in here is not the best, but it's okay. So, like I said, this is kind of just a filler 
in between sets because I had the urge, had the itch, got to scratch it, got to crack it. Ooh, nice. Ghoul Collar Gisa, which is Cauldron. That's a nice one, too. Village Rights. as wide as we'll go how low can we go you can still see these guys yeah that's good all right mm -hmm, mm -hmm. what are we doing here okay. oh devilish again boo Come on, dinos, vampires, Phyrexians, elves, where are you at, bro? Where are you at? Sorry. So Rizoth, Chaos Rider. I'm sure you guys know what's in most of these. So this is kind of just to see if it's Pound Town or if it's any good. Yeah, pretty much just chat about the new set. What's everybody excited about? Leave a comment, let me know. Are you even excited about Streets of New Companion? Are you still riding high on Kamigawa Neon Dynasty? Still looking for those uh, Neon Treated cards? I know I was, I wanted to, but I could. I just can't, can't keep going. You know, you gotta budget sometimes. Lightning, Lightning Phoenix. Lightning Bolt's always a great card. What was the other one? Living Lightning, Lightning Axe, another great card. Come on, big hitter. Ugh, other friends, boo. So I bought a case of these, Jumpstart. They're really cheap up here in Canada. Got them for I think one one twenty plus tax, so I was like, yeah, Angel of Dire Hour, nice. I was like, yeah, buy a case of those, you know, for when for when the itch hits, so I don't fall susceptible to opening some Modern Horizons two or any of the good boxes that I have. The Double Masters, I have some Double Masters 1, bought a case of that and a case of VIP, but their prices are absolutely skyrocketing. skyrocketing. Um, so I definitely don't want to crack those because, uh, yeah, it's just, they're just good investment. I'm saving all my money for Double Masters 2, and I'm going to try and buy as many boxes as I can. Like, literally. Oh, Liliana. Nice. So that might be the thumbnail right there, actually. Beautiful. Hello, sexy lady. Hello, sexy lady. I'm actually going to sleeve her right away so she doesn't get any damage. Say so that's probably the biggest hit. Come on, you. Out of the box. Right? Pretty sure Lily's the biggest hitter. Sexy. Love it. I'll leave her up there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Give her her own little spot. Of course, Liliana's standard bear. Beauty. What do we get for the land for her? The swampy. Put him in his own little area. Nice. Put her right in the middle. Look at that. That's, that literally works out perfect. For the thumbnail. Yeah. Literally saving all my money. Like, I only bought a couple boxes. Literally, I think, one of each. One set, one draft, and one collectors of New Capanna. Because I, uh, I'm literally saving all my money for... A big, a big position, not big position, but for me, for my budget, big position in Double Masters. I'm going to try and get at least maybe 
10 or 20 boxes of draft and maybe 10 or 20 dogs pack leader love it uh with double masters hopefully with uh some good connections from a friend i've met through matt ellis and cracking packs mtg a man by the name of uh fatty mcfatterson uh look at that beautiful dog land definitely saving that guy so hopefully that connection bears fruit. I'll be very happy. Very happy to just crack all of the Double Masters 2 boxes for you guys and make as many videos as possible. Maybe even give away a box. I would love to do that and do some box breaks or battles for people. So again, tell your friends. Let them know that I'm interested in that and let me know if you're interested in some box breaks. Heavily Armored. Guthrie's Crusade. And Zealand. Is, uh, I don't even know what that is. Oblivion Stone. Looks like something. Some kind of cool stone. About halfway through the box. Really the only hit was Liliana. I'm not sure what she's priced at. I don't think she's as much as the uh, Allosaurus. Uh, Shepherd, but ooh, rogues. I don't think I've ever had rogues before. Funny enough, I'm not quite sure it's in this. Let go. And yeah, thieves guide enforcer. Okay, okay, that's cool. And the land is a pretty cool looking swap, so I'm gonna save that one too. Rogues. All right, come on, dinos, elves, vampires. Oh, plus one, boo. Anybody else mind you of cigarettes when you open these? I never smoked, but I've definitely opened a pack or two in my time. Rishkar, Pima Regen Renegade, not bad. I actually love Hydras. I know everybody hates them and thinks they're stupid or whatever, but I've always been a fan. I've always been a fan of dragons and just big creatures and just boss them out, going crazy. Oh, under the sea. That's not what we want to see. Unless they had like a Kiora, that'd be cool. There was this another Planeswalker. Yeah, definitely not Pursued Whale. Whelming wave. Wow, wow. Island. At least we're getting pretty decent variety, so can't complain with that. Only two duplications so far. Lands. All right. I don't even know what this one is. I don't think I've ever had a land pack either. So oh, this will be a surprise. Okay. Hydra for mythic number four. Not bad. Cultivate. Keep that on. She's a beauty. What land do we get for this land? That's a pretty cool forest. Keep that one too. Alright. About oh, two thirds through the box. Ugh. Seismic. I've definitely never opened this one before. I'm assuming this is going to be Chandra. No, because Chandra is her own pack. Grim Lava Mancer. I don't even know. Is this a good hit? Guys, let me know. Let me know in the comments. And volcanoes. I like volcanoes. Oh, running out of room. Running out of room. Here. Yeah. Condense the packs. So we got six packs left. Move Liliana over. I'll put this one with 
this. Give us some more room here. Six packs left. Come on. Good cards. Whoa, vampires. Come on. What do we want? What do we want? Uh, it's not bad. I'll take it. What did we want? We wanted the uh, the bite or the uh, what's it called? Vampire. Oh, I can't remember what the card is. It's a vampire. He's biting into a neck. But we'll take take drama. She used to be a huge hit back in like BFZ days. Oh, that's Dracula's castle. You see that? Pretty dope. Save that. Take that. Take that to the bank. Eh. Come on. There we go. Oh, Kalaji. Boo. Scarecrone. All right. Top. Come on, last couple of packs. Give me something. Oh, boo. See, I love how, like, you can triple hit on, like, the worst ones. Why can't you triple hit on vampires? Why can't you triple hit on Liana, Liliana, right? Bunch of BS, I tell ya. BS. Ah, we don't care. All right. Three packs, last three packs. Come on, baby, baby, come on, baby, come on. Oh, angels, eh. I like a good angel. Good for the soul, right? Maybe, so, yeah, no. <sighs> Bane Slayer Angel. Oh, we only get one? But I think that's the best one, right? It's the Mythic. I can't remember. Let me know if I'm right or wrong. Last two packs. <sighs> Ooh, unicorns. That's decent. Pretty sure it's guaranteed. Mythic, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Right at the top. Last pack. Will it be last pack magic? Drum roll, please. Uh, want, want. That's okay. Like I said, we got plenty more boxes in the case to get all the good stuff. Naith of the Dire Hunt. Not even a look. We don't care. We got the Lily. Thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate you. Like, subscribe. Again, let me know if you're interested in any type of battles. Um, for, well, I guess not Jumpstart, but I'll, I'll let you know if I come across any other boxes and definitely in, uh, the summer for double masters to tell your friends, I will hopefully have lots of those. So thanks for watching. Peace.